Hey, what's up viewers? How's it going? I've just been so stressed out in the past day because my internet keeps crashing and I can't make videos for you guys. So obviously I got it working and I can make videos again. So in my last video I asked you guys, what's your religion? And this is what you guys said. Today's question of the day is, who do you guys look up to? Okay, so hopefully this will be the last time I ever talk about this again. Kate Middleton and Prince William has finally named their baby. So the future king is going to be named George Alexander Lewis. If you guys been watching my videos, in my last video, I actually predicted that the baby's name is gonna be George. That's so sick, I actually guessed the name of the royal baby. I should be getting like money or cookies or something. Okay, I'm not that special, let's move on. Amanda Bynes has gone absolutely nuts. Note that she isn't already. Recently, she was caught setting fire on a random stranger's driveway. She came up to the driveway with a small gas tank, poured it on the driveway, and just lit it. What the heck is she trying to do, have a barbecue? This happened in the suburbs of Los Angeles, and the news is saying there's no connection between the stranger and Amanda Bynes. The owner of the house was interviewed and was asked, does she have a vendetta against you? The house owner replied with, we don't even know each other. So when she poured the gasoline onto the driveway, her pant leg actually caught on fire. And also, her dog. Like, who does that? Why would you bring your dog into something so stupid? So after all that happened, she picked up her dog and ran to the closest convenience store. So the convenience store actually has a surveillance tape of her running into the store. When she went in there, she used an employee sink to wash off the dog. Employees got suspicious of this lady just barging in like that that they called 911. So as soon as she finished washing off the dog and left the convenience store, she was arrested by the cops. So right now she's being held on a 5150 hold, which means she's in an involuntary psychiatric hold. They want to evaluate her to see what state of mind that she's in. And they're allowed to keep her in there against her will for 72 hours. How about we change that law and just, uh, just keep her in there? Okay, so last story of the day for you guys, and it's stupidity at its greatest. A 16-year-old boy from Northern Greece decided to take a gun and shoot himself right in the foot. And this is because he wanted to impress his girlfriend. He was going to tell her that he was a hero. He was going to tell her that an intruder tried to break into his house. And this is when he took out his gun and scared him away while getting shot in the foot. He told investigators that story, but they did not believe him. Buddy, you're telling me an intruder came in, you scared him away, but how the hell did you get shot in the foot? So eventually the truth came out. He was telling the police officer that he wanted to impress his girlfriend. And he thought he wouldn't get that hurt by shooting himself in the foot. So right now doctors have operated on his foot and he's expected to have a full recovery. But the story doesn't finish there. His father is now facing charges for having an illegal possession of a firearm. And also for child neglect. Wow, I would be so pissed off at my son. Anyways guys, that's all the news stories I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed that one and I'll see you guys in my next video.